course, they're both just numbers. Um, so we're all here because we love mathematics. We love teaching mathematics. We love creating mathematics. We love learning mathematics. And we're living in one of the great ages of mathematics of all time, both on the research front, but even in its popularization. It, it's a, a totally different world than when I was young. But there's one significant part of the math world that we lack. One thing that I assume that all of us wish would happen more, and that's math as public performance. We dream of not just having a dry lecture like this up here, but having math performed in auditoriums, stadiums, thousands, tens of thousands, sixty thousand, a hundred thousand people in an auditorium watching mathematics being done. Go ahead, prove that theorem. Prove that theorem. Oh, that would be color commentators going, oh my god, oh my god, I think you should just try for a counterexample. This is, uh, no one ever thought of proving that theorem this way before, and everyone would go crazy. <laughs> we can imagine cheerleaders coming out and saying, give me an M. Yeah. Give me an A. A. Give me a T. G. Give me an H. H. What does it spell? Yeah. <laughs> and then they come out and we can imagine them saying, Give me an E. G. What does it spell? G. <laughs> oh, and everyone's going crazy. And then everyone <clears throat> rises up in one and starts chanting. Na 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 hey hey pie goodbye na 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 hey hey pie goodbye thank you <laughs> okay audience it's down to you you must decide by voting once and only once, will conduct this undeniably fair poll by voice vote. I'll first ask if you're in favor of pi and then E. Are you ready? Really? Are you ready? Yeah. Okay. All those in favor of pi, say pi. Pi. All those in favor of E, say E. E. Well, folks, I think E has it. Let's congratulate <laughs> Professor Garrity and Professor Adams for their dedicated debates tonight. I know I feel invigorated and like I know a lot more now. Thank you. Uh, and in the immortal words of Norton Jester, to the vector belong the spoils. <laughs> Sorry, the truth went out. Yeah. 